Jen, I hope you're enjoying my theatrical performance. And I've got like four brilliant actors with me. You've seen them all this morning, throughout this morning. They've been entertaining me and you guys as well. I've got Lynette, Drew, Robbie, and Cassie with me. And they've been just absolutely fantastic. Thank you for making my morning. I love it, guys. It's brought some great, great memories. Now, Lynette, I want to first ask you, when, it, when you guys come together, because there are a total of 30 cast members, 29 cast members for Mamma Mia, right? Correct. And so how do you guys prepare for such a, an amazing, like a big show like Mamma Mia? Well, as actors, the first thing we do uh, is warm up vocally. Okay. Uh, uh, so one of the vo vocal warm ups we do, we can show you. Yeah, I'd like to see that. Absolutely. Let's go. All right. So. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Thank you for plugging <laughs> our channel, X, Y, Z. There you go. And, and, and you guys do this every day to, and day, day and night to rehearse for it because, you know, it's not like once you've rehearsed your lines, you're good to go. You have to keep doing this every time, correct? Yes. Yeah. Now, Drew, let me ask you this. Now, with the pandemic hit, the, you know, you, pretty much all stage performance were shut down, like every other business. So, what was it, what did it mean for you guys for not being able to perform? Um, just personally, like theater is such a big part of life, and I, I think can probably speak for everybody, um, and especially in this area, whether it's local community or you know the the touring cast that come through stuff like that. It's it's a huge part of the culture in Detroit and, and the surrounding area. So, not having that for two years just felt like a, a large chunk of what we did is missing, and it's just feels great to be back on stage and performing and. And sitting in front of a live audience and you know not having a mask on my face and blocking everything <laughs> I'm saying and actually being able to see people's expressions and, and you know right. and read lips and everything like that so right. yeah it's, it's great to be back and that's actually a magical experience itself just to connect with your viewers and your audience members and to feel that energy so Robbie that brings me to you what makes theater more exciting for you guys when you perform here every night well, to be a part of an amazing cast, <laughs> you know, I, we, we become like family. Right. So, and then we practice for three months, putting on th these amazing shows with all the sets and all the people, and just to see the uh, reaction from the audience is what makes it all worth it. And now I'm part of the family as well, right? Absolutely. Yeah, and yeah. like money, money, money. <laughs> Your cast. I'm done. Let's do this. All right, Jen, we're going to be doing this, all right? Okay. And of course, Cassie. How can people come down and watch this amazing show that you guys put up? Well, why tell you uh -oh. when we can show you? <laughs> <laughs> Mamma Mia, running May 6th through the 29th. Buy your tickets now at stagecrafters.org. Damn it! <laughs> I love it. All right. You guys have to come down here and watch the show. Nothing better than this, all right? Stage Crafters, Baldwin Theater in Royal Oak. Jen, back to you. I know you're going to be watching this. I'll get you your tickets. Don't worry, I got you. Absolutely. What beautiful voices. And Faraz, my hat goes off to you as well for your performance. Thanks for that live report.